Hi, this is Ryan. Today I'm going to show you how to set up a scene and an event that will watch your motion sensors and then put your house into away mode when it appears that nobody's at home. So what I'm going to do first of all for this is define a scene. A scene basically takes a set of lights and the other devices that you've got and, and sticks them at certain levels, certain predefined levels. So I'm going to create the scene of how I want my house to look when I'm away. And I'm going to call this scene Away. And first of all, I want to add a few devices here. So I'm going to pick my bar lights and my dining room lights. And I also think I'll turn my thermostat down as well. So I'll pick those three devices that I'm interested in controlling. And I'll leave the bar lights at off as well as the dining room lights. Now the thermostat, I'm going to tell it that when I'm away, I want the, the cool to go up to 85 so that it doesn't try to cool my house down. And I'm going to do the same with the heat. I'm going to stick it at about 65. That's a good economy setting right there. Now let's go over to the rules page. Rules are basically events that you can program to fire when certain conditions are met. For this particular one, let's go ahead and create a new rule. I'm going to call it away mode. And go ahead and find it in our list here. If you want, you can put in the description. You don't need to. I'm going to leave these as default settings. The trigger basically says what's going to activate this, this rule and we're going to leave it on a specified date so that we can make it repeatable and I'm just going to make it repeat every 15 minutes so it'll check the conditions every 15 minutes and then activate the scene if they've been met. So go into real data real fast and we'll get the basics down. This date isn't very important I'm just going to use today's date and I want it to start checking at 8 a.m. again this isn't isn't very important because we're going to make it just repeat and here's how we set up the repeating. Click on interval. I want it to repeat every 15 minutes. So I'll just type in minutes here. And for interval number, I'll put in 15. Now, every 15 minutes, we want this scene to be scene to be activated. So I'm going to go find the away the away scene. It should be right here at the bottom. And I'll save that. So how I've got this defined right now is my heat and the whole entire house that I've specified in that scene will go into way mode every 15 minutes and that's obviously not what we want. We want it to only go into way mode if certain conditions are met. So you'll notice this conditions button right here. Let's go take a look at that. Now in my home I've got a motion sensor. I've got two of them for the main living areas in my house and I'm, I want to watch those motion sensors and when they when they have been off or in other words when they haven't detected motion for 60 minutes that's when I want to trigger this event. So I'm going to go ahead and pick this very first one right here. Okay, so I can go in here and I can click on these blue areas. These are pot linked. So I'll click on the device one and I'm going to go find my motion sensor. Here's my first one. So what I'm saying here is when my motion sensor has been equal to a certain level, zero means that the motion sensor hasn't detected anything. And I want to say I want this to be 60 minutes. Okay, so this rule now is only valid after the motion has been at zero or off for 60 minutes. I'm going to go ahead and add one more condition because I've got my second motion sensor in my house that I also want to be part of this. So I'm going to click that. I'm going to go find my second motion sensor. Again, let's choose these, set it to zero, and 60 minutes. Okay, so what this is effectively going to do is that every 15 minutes, again, recall that in our rule data we set up a repeatable event that happens every 15 minutes, we're going to check the values of the motion and motion two sensors, make sure they're zero, and also make sure that they've been at zero for 60 minutes each. As soon as that's happened, 
these two are met, as soon as these are both true, then the scene that we created will be activated, at which point my two lights, my bar lights, and my dining room lights will be set to zero and my heat will be turned down to 65. And that's it. That's basically how we can make our house a little bit smarter, a little more economic, and watch and learn when we're home and then set the house into away mode. Thanks for watching.